So, who are your top five favorite entrepreneurs? One, Elon Musk. Two, Bill Gates. Three, Steve Jobs. Four, Mark Zuckerberg. Five, Jeff Bezos. Why is Elon Musk your favorite entrepreneur? Elon Musk is my favorite entrepreneur because he is a true visionary. He has changed the world with his innovative thinking, and he is always looking for new ways to make a difference. What would you say is the most impressive thing about Elon Musk? I think the most impressive thing about Elon Musk is his ability to turn his vision into reality. Will Elon Musk get humans to Mars? I think Elon Musk has a good chance of getting humans to Mars. He is a true visionary, and he has the resources to make it happen. Is Tesla's stock overpriced? I think Tesla's stock is overpriced. The stock has been on a bit of a roller coaster ride lately, and I think it's due for a correction. Do you think that Dogecoin is overpriced? I think Dogecoin is overpriced. So, what is your favorite Elon Musk company? My favorite Elon Musk company is Tesla. I think Tesla is a great company that is changing the world with its innovative products. Got it. Okay. And what is your second favorite Elon Musk company? My second favorite Elon Musk company is SpaceX. I think SpaceX is doing amazing things in the aerospace industry, and I can't wait to see what they do next. And what do you think of Elon Musk's company Neuralink? I think Neuralink is a great company. Hmm. Okay.、Uh, don't you think it's a little bit weird to implant things into people's heads? I think it's definitely a little weird to implant things into people's heads, but I think it's also amazing. I think Neuralink is doing amazing things in the field of neuroscience, and I can't wait to see what they do next. Fair enough. What do you think about Elon Musk's quote, which I'm paraphrasing, which is starting a business is like chewing glass and staring into the void. I think Elon Musk is a great entrepreneur, and I think he knows what he's talking about. Starting a business is definitely not easy, but it's worth it if you're passionate about what you're doing. Wow, that is really interesting that you knew that that was a negative connotation. I'm pretty impressed by that. But I'm interested in becoming rich. How do you recommend I do that? There's no easy answer when it comes to becoming rich. But one key thing to remember is that it takes hard work and dedication. While there's no guarantee you'll become a millionaire, if you're willing to put in the effort, anything is possible. Got it. So it's more like a likelihood thing. So what careers are most likely to make me a millionaire? There's no definitive answer when it comes to which careers are most likely to make someone a millionaire. But typically, high-paying jobs such as investment bankers, surgeons, and CEOs are more likely to lead to millionaire status. Got it. And am I more likely to become a millionaire? Uh, by having a job or becoming a business owner. Typically, those who own their own businesses have a higher potential to reach millionaire status than those who rely solely on jobs. Okay, cool. So, what is the most valuable skill I can learn to land a high-paying job or start a successful business? Some skills that are commonly sought after include salesmanship, financial management, and leadership. And what are some of the most common skills that millionaires have? The most common skills millionaires have include financial planning, investing, and networking. What type of investing has created the most millionaires? Typically, those who invest in stocks and real estate have a higher potential to become millionaires than those who don't invest at all. Okay, so what is your personal favorite type of investing? I typically prefer stocks and real estate investing because of the potential for higher returns. Got it. And what is the best way to invest in stocks in the United States of America? I typically prefer to invest in blue chip stocks or index funds because they tend to be more stable and have less risk. I would agree with you there. So, what is more important to somebody who's young, making money or investing it? Making money because it gives you the opportunity to grow your wealth over time. Got it. And what age, on average, are millionaires? Most millionaires are older adults who have been steadily building their wealth over many years. Okay. And what are some examples of good passive income methods? Some examples of good passive income methods include investing in stocks, real estate, and bonds. Okay. Got it. And what are five examples of good business ideas that you can start? One, start a blog. Two, start an e-commerce business. Three, start a dropshipping business. Four, start a subscription service. Five, start a coaching business. Wow, those are actually really good suggestions. So, would you say it's better to start an online business or a brick and mortar business? Typically, online businesses have a lower startup cost and are more flexible. Got it. And are there any good ways to make money with AI? Starting your own business. Agreed. There are a lot of really cool business opportunities that are popping up right now that involve AI. I'm super excited about this, and I think it's just amazing. Thanks so much for doing this interview with me. Also, check this video out right here. I made it just for you. Go ahead, gently tap that like button, hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and comment down below any thoughts, comments, criticisms, etc. That you have on the video, and I will see you next time.